I, I can't believe this is going to work, but we'll try it. Okay, we'll get the egg out. It killed him! No, Merchant, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Merchant. How's it going, crew? This is Happy Days, and welcome back to our story about Super Modern Let's Play. And, oh my gosh, I've got that new cloud in a bottle thing, and I am still getting used to it. But as you can see, guys, we are underground. Oh, goodness, no. Okay, we are underground, and we are searching for some... Oh my gosh, this bottle is so crazy. We are searching for some gemstones. Oh, what's this stuff? Oh my gosh, that looks kind of cool. Let's dig our way through to this. We're looking for some gemstones. I'd really like to get a grappling hook. Okay, what is this? Can I mine this stuff? No, it doesn't look like I can mine it, but I want to. Oh, goodness. Yeah, we are so... Oh, thorium. Yes, I need this. Oh, my goodness. We are searching for some gemstones. Try again, Happy. Uh, yes, there's some there. Uh, so we can get our grappling hook because I would like to start fighting some bosses. Uh, in today's video, but uh, I don't have a hook. I have a crazy bottle, which is not helping much. Let's get rid of this slimy. Get out of here. And now we found some thorium. I can craft some inspiration notes uh, when I turn these into nice bars and the thorium an anvil, which will be absolutely amazing. And hang on. Is this amethyst? Oh, I think I actually... Amethyst is the... Whoa! Amethyst is the one. What's a deer doing down here? Oh my gosh, this bottle is so crazy. Oh, it's that firestorm in a bottle. We got in our last video, but it, like, propels you everywhere. Oh, my goodness. Okay, how am I going to do this? I'm going to rope my way up here. All under control, people. Oh, just while we're getting started, too, uh, letting you guys know, if you haven't checked out our merch store yet, uh, we have our brand new Britney design in store. I'll put it on screen now so you can check it out. Ah, I can't get up there. I want the thorium. Oh, okay, I need some platforms. Uh, yeah, I'll put a link on screen. Go check it out. It is amazing. Big thanks to TKD Corey uh, for designing that. I can't wait. Uh, to check it out myself. I've ordered one of the stickers, uh, which is amazing. It's t-shirts, jumpers, all that good stuff. <gasps> There's some more thorium there. Look at all this ore. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, that mine, that, is that iron, all of that? Oh my gosh, no! No, Bolden, no, what? I was looking at the ore, oh, not in the intro. No! Yeah, okay, okay, I might have died on the way back, no need to panic, and I am turning off this bottle, it's driving me crazy, it is the silliest bottle ever, oh my goodness, now, because we have lovely vein miner, I don't need to play around with the explosives today, it's all good, now, have I got some bombs, <gasps> yes, it's gonna make this much quicker, let's throw some nice bombs in there, and we're gonna blast our way through people, ah, beautiful, check this out, and I wonder if I can blow up the thorium ore, that would make me a very happy, happy indeed, oh yes, I can. Okay, lovely. Let's get some of that. Beautiful. And now I need some sticky bombs. Oh, goodness. This is out of control. But um, anyway, yeah, so we were thinking of doing... <clears throat> sorry, pardon me. We're thinking of doing one new design for the merch store each month, and we can sort of do combinations of characters. So I have a special one coming up in a few weeks' time. But uh, yeah, if you've got any suggestions, let me know in the comments below. But we are going to keep making our way around. I've got eight amethysts. We have stacks of thorium ore. This is incredible. And I think I can see a mushroom biome uh, down there. So we're going to make our way around here, past all the buttons. Oh my gosh, they're like blowing fire. No, stay away from me. You crazy things. Oh my gosh. And I, oh, hard crystal. Yes, hearts are happy. Okay, we need that. Get back, get back, you crazy thing. Okay, beautiful. There's some inspiration. Oh goodness. There's like, what's that? A dragon? night elemental no stay back ah! okay there we go i need to get up here i need to make a little path i don't have any wood in my inventory so i can't use platforms oh goodness oh stay back all right i want some of these lovely mushrooms all right let's use our didgeridoo okay and they're dropping oh boulder oh they're everywhere today oh my gosh and that drops some uh draconite shards Oh, check it out. It's like um, some early game stuff. That's pretty cool. I like that. But I need to get through to this heart. And I can see another boulder there. Oh, my gosh. Oh, this is out of control. Oh, there's some more gems as well. Okay, maybe I can blow them up. Although, I think that's a modded ore. Because it looks like there's two types of gemmies in there. Anyway, let's throw a um, let's throw a sticky bomb and see what happens. Okay, and we'll dig through here while that's going. Oh, I can blow it up. What is it? Element Enchanted shards. Okay, we'll throw another one on there for now. 
I think I might have found that in another video. Boulder, no, stay right away from me. Ooh. And I kind of want to explore the rest of this biome as well. So let's see if I can get up here. We should be fine. All right, we'll dig our way through. Oh, nice lake. No need to panic. Oh, gosh. But anyway, I really want to find Eye of Cthulhu. And uh, we could probably also try and get to Eater of Worlds today, which would be amazing. And we're going to explore a little bit more of this because, as you guys know, I love a little bit of spelunking fun. <gasps> There's some of that coal stuff. Okay, let's get some. Of oh, no, let's just keep using sticky bombs. This is much quicker. <laughs> I love it. Oh, gosh. Now, in uh, the last video, which way should we go, left or right? Uh, let's go left. Why not? I put a poll uh, and I asked if you guys want me to add some buildings off camera and a lot of you were like yes yes go for it oh, there's some more amethyst so what I might start to do is if I've got some spare time I might just jump into Brittany's world and do a little bit of building which will be very fun indeed okay let's get back up here very nice I'm gonna make our way along here and see if there's anything new oh, look at all these gems this gems for days oh my gosh let's just throw more bombs oh this is out of control people I'm loving it okay I have destroyed the minecart track but for now we can keep exploring now do I actually need what does this make it makes, okay, it makes like magic sort of stuff. Well, we're playing a bard, so we don't really need magic armor. So I'm going to skip that for now. Whoa, that thing is strong. <gasps> That's another one of those Draconite thingies. Okay, we might get some more hearts, which reminds me. Let's use our heart crystal. Very nice. And oh, it looks like this might be end of the line, people. Hang on, can I get up here? <gasps> a secret room. Okay, let's uh, let's jump up here. We'll put some little platforms. <laughs> well, I'm using stone as a platform now, but that's fine. And we'll dig our way through the box here. Ah, here we go. And there's like some random modded ore that's spawned in the room. Do you guys find that when you have mods enabled? Sometimes it does like really weird stuff with the world generation. And we got a bronze candle. Uses five mana, more chest loot. Did that just set me on fire? What on earth is that? Oh, that's crazy. Anyway, I think we got enough stuff. Let's get back to the surface and get ready for a boss fight. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, it's time to upgrade to Thorium stuff. I'm so excited, people. Oh, so let's go through our nice new house, which the NPCs seem to be enjoying. I need to dig up my old anvil. And now what we should be able... Oh, that's right, you guys were asking me to make this sapling into something so I can have a glow stick sapling or a shield sapling. Oh, we should probably make one to defend me, uh, which is kind of nice. It can hold the little shield up and hopefully keep us safe. Now, let's see. I can make the Thorium Anvil. And I put that down there. Now that works just like a normal uh, anvil as well. And I can make a stack of thorium bars. Well, I got I got 17 now. If I use the arcane dust and the things, I need a demon altar to make some inspiration. So we'll make as many as I can. I've got some potions ready. So what I'll do is I'm going to farm up some lenses. Oh, I got another life crystal from... Was, oh, that was from the King Slimy. I did the quest. Uh, I should also be able to make amethyst hook. Very good, very good. Let's get that. Uh, so I'll farm up a suspicious eye and uh, make a little arena and let's get ready for our next boss fight, people. So I'm making my way down into the corruption to make some uh, inspiration notes. And I thought I should share it with you guys because I haven't, I don't think I've made inspiration before. So I don't actually know what it looks like when you craft them. So I thought we'll go down here and see what's going on. Oh, is that a pile of money? Oh my gosh, did I miss that? How did I miss that? Anyway, so let's see. I can make my suspicious looking eye. Very nice. And here it is, inspiration fragment. So you just right click them. Okay, beautiful. And how do you use them? Do I just go like, boom? Okay, two, two, two. Hang on, get away. I'm using inspiration. Ah! Oh, check it out. There's like more rings around the, 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 the thingy now. So, oh, that's kind of like the, the stamina bar in uh, Legend of Zelda. Oh my gosh, that's pretty cool. Anyway, so we have more inspiration. We're ready for a boss fight. Let's do it, people. Ah, what a lovely night. I'm collecting some fallen stars and I have my nice new arena. And I was just killing some zombies, and I noticed some of them are dropping these quest items. Uh, because I got a quest to put the fishing rod together for one of the anti harasa uh, NPCs. But they keep dropping the same part over and over again. So I'm not quite sure how that works, but uh, alright, we'll kill one more. We'll see if we get it. Okay, oh, it's, no, I don't want any more of the same thing. Anyway, let's get our bumps on. Let's get ready for this boss fight in 3, 2, 1, boom! Here we go. So let's get our musical piano y thing down and uh, let's use some tambourine action here. No, Happy, what are you doing? Alright, let's try this. Whoa! Oh, look at the damage. That is awesome. Okay, let's use some of our didgeridoo. And uh, I think our horn will be pretty nice as well. So as you can see, guys, we're doing some pretty nice damage. We can take out the little servants of Cthulhu pretty easily. Now, is there still zombies down here? Give me that fishing rod. Oh, my gosh. Did I get it? Did I get it? I don't know. I think I might have got it. Oh, 
Anyway, I make that at a um, I make that at a workbench afterwards. But we have to beat this boss first, people. So as you can see, my inspiration still runs out pretty fast indeed. And I think um, some of our instruments use mana, so we're gonna have to look at getting some of that. Ah, is my piano still there? Ooh. Okay, let's take these things out. Didgeridoo's helping a lot with that. That's pretty nice. Let's jump over there. Beautiful. Let's get some horn action. Oh, I haven't used my um, harmonica either. That's actually pretty nice. It does some pretty good direct damage and it like attacks multiple times at once. Ah, Happy, what are you doing? Ooh. No, you crazy eyeball. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Ooh. No. Oh, goodness. Okay. It's all under control, people. Ooh. Alright, let's get some nice attacks in there. It's chasing me. Beautiful. We'll get up here. Alright, let's try some horn. Okay, the horn does pretty good damage because, um, yeah, it's got a really good range on it. Oh my gosh. Now, I think we can get a new armor set uh, once we beat the Eater of Worlds. So that would be pretty nice too. Oh, goodness. Leave me alone, eyeball. What should I use? Let's try the horn thingy. The harp? I don't know. Oh, okay, we'll finish it off with the horn. Beautiful. Take it. Don't stop dodging me, you crazy eyeball. Ah, yes, we got it. Is that a giant egg? What? Unlimited merchant killer? What? It says the desert rumbles. What's this? What? 12,000 damage? What on earth is that? Because oh, they never asked if they could move in. Oh, so does that... It just throws eggs. And do these literally do 12,000 damage? Let's try in the bunny. Let's... Let's no, it doesn't kill the bunny. Does it kill that thing? Hey, it threw an axe at me. What? Stop it. <laughs> Leave me alone. Okay, well, we got some treasure, and I think I finished the fishing rod. So let's open our treasure. Three, two, one, boom. <gasps> wow. Decisive leash of Cthulhu. Is that like a. Whoa! Check that thing out. That's huge. Oh, that's amazing. And what's this? Decisive the third eye. Oh, it's like a homing attack. Wow. And uh, Grognax Shield of Cthulhu. What on earth? Oh, I think I might replace that with my little spritey thing because I really want Dash. It's so useful. But uh, I think we've pretty much got everything. Let's try and hand this quest in with the fishing rod because that is pretty cool as well. Should we try and kill the merchant? All right, where is where is the merchant? We're going to test this egg on him. Hello, merchant. Where, where is he? Where's the merchant hiding? Oh, I went right past him. All right. I, I can't believe this is going to work, but we'll try it. Okay, we'll get the egg out. It killed him! No, merchant, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, merchant. Oh, oh no. Anyway, we should be able to make the fishing rod. Okay, let's get that. And uh, I think this, this adventurer guy asked for it. Okay, quest. Thank you for your help. I really appreciate it. Okay, so we got an adventurer's sack. All right, more treasure. Let's open this up. Let's get rid of some of the junky stuff. All right, three, two, one, boom. Oh, wow, Ink Monster. Oh, my gosh, I was going to play that game. I got Iron Coin used for buying things in... Oh, there's so many mods going on. This is out of control. And I got a Tooth of Cthulhu that's a quest item. This is insane. Holy moly, there's so much stuff. Anyway, I need to sort my inventory and, uh, yeah, let's zoom ahead, guys. Oh, I totally didn't realize, but I think it dropped a life crystal, and uh, I almost missed that. So let's just throw that. Ah, what's this? Runestone. Ah, we're getting all this new magic stuff. Holy moly. All right, let's just throw away these arrows. I don't need them. So more life. Oh my gosh, we're going to be invincible soon. Bards are so strong. So we're here in the desert, and it says there is a cactoid that I need to defeat for a quest. And uh, it is hiding down this passageway here, and oh, I see you there, you little cactus. Oh, it can fly! It can go through blocks and it can fly! No! Stay away from me! Quick, piano, save me! Ooh. Okay, this thing's pretty strong, but it's no match for my didgeridoo. I'm running out of inspiration, though. Ah, quick horn, horn. I don't think the horn uses inspiration. Ooh. This thing is crazy! Get away from me! Alright, there we go. It's just chilling. Whoa! Oh my goodness, it's doing the needle attack! Ooh. Okay. I'm turning off the map. I need I need to see what I'm doing. No! No! There's too many enemies around. Ooh. Okay, let's get in here. Oh, you crazy cactus. Oh, I can't believe I can go through blocks. Stop spawning so many enemies around me. Ah! No! Oh, goodness. I don't want to die. Okay, don't do the cactus attack. Oh, there's a tornado. No, it's shooting cactus needles at me. Ah! No! Oh! 
Also, I think I can upgrade my tambourine. Uh, now I've got some demon. All right, let's just try and kill it. <gasps> no, it gets defense when it does that. No, needles, no. I'm sorry. Okay, there we go. All right, the needles can only go so far. Oh, gosh, you crazy cactus. Ah! Okay, I've got the cactoid flower. Where's that? Oh, goodness. Oh, it's from Juiced Mod. Okay. Oh, goodness. Okay, let's go back to piano. So let's end in this quest. I better get something good for this silly cactus. Ah, uh, the sun is setting on another chaotic day, but I will make the new tambourine uh, before we rush ahead here because I really would like to make the upgraded one. There it is. So I can change my normal tambourine into an Ebonwood one. And I believe that means I can throw more of them now. Oh, check it out. So I can throw more, but it just takes a little bit of inspiration. When I do it, can I upgrade it? No, but it gives me bonus damage. So that's pretty nice. All right, let's hand in your silly quest. I got two gold. And what was the thing I got? A hasty, hasty cactoid, hack, cactoid commendation. It gives me non-corrupted cactoid, occasionally summons a cactoid. Okay, that's pretty cool. And I can equip it like an item. All right, that's pretty awesome. So defense against cactuses. <laughs> but uh, anyway, guys, looking at the time, we'll start to wrap that up there for today. Thanks so much for watching as always. Make sure you check out our merch store and check out our new Britney designs. I'm really excited about them. Smash the like button if you're enjoying our series. And and subscribe if you just want to see more content from me. And here's the most important part, as always. You'll stay happy, and I'll see you soon. This is Happy Days signing out. See ya.